In this video, we'll be solving the devices active issue when trying to install Bazite or other atomic desktops. You'll typically get this error if you're trying to replace Windows with Bazite and BitLock is enabled. Let me show you what it looks like in the Bazite installer. When we go to Installation Destination, free up space by removing or shrinking existing partitions. When we click on Done, over here you can see that this Windows partition is labeled BitLocker. When we choose to remove the partition, we get the device's active error as the installer starts. Let's get rid of this BitLocker partition. Since Bazite doesn't have a live mode, and since I want to do this in a, with a GUI, we're going to boot Linux Mint to solve this problem. Now that Mint is booted, we're going to open Gparted. Gparted has no issue with removing this BitLocker partition. So we just select the partition, click on Delete. And while we're here, we might as well remove the other Windows partitions. So we have a blank slate for our Bazite installation. Don't forget to click on the Apply button. And when we apply, you can see this is quite a quick operation. Let's jump back to the Bazite installer. Now for the disks, we just need to select the disk that we want to install. Make sure you select the right one. We don't have to do anything about removing partitions. We just select uh, Done. And the next part is a good idea. You'd probably want to change the user to a different username. So we're just going to, I'm going to make a tester. You can, you'd make it your normal username. Now that we have everything set up, we just hit the Begin Installation button. I'm going to speed this part up. There we go, Bazite is installed. As you can see, it is relatively simple to solve the device's active issue. Thank you for watching. I hope that you found this guide helpful. Have a lovely day. Goodbye.